ladies and gentlemen, this is really important because potentially you could have a budding mobile DJ in your house and you have no idea what to get them, you're very confused and possibly you're thinking if you phone some shop somewhere around the UK, they're going to sell you stuff you don't need. Well, get in the mix. What they have done is brought together the complete package. Now, this isn't B stock, this is all new products, and every item you have will make you become a mobile DJ. In other words, every single piece of kit I'm going to show you now means that you can go and set it up, take it to the venue, and you can work as a mobile DJ. Now, the only other piece of kit you will need is of course your laptop and your music and you should have that already so what do you get now I can't give you the exact price but it's gonna be about a thousand pounds the best thing to do is of course to contact getinamix.com and ask them for the mobile DJ package so let's have a look you get First of all, the complete DJ console. They come with the scrims, and if we take a look on the inside, you will also get the Gorilla Stand. Now, this, you have ample room to place, of course, the Newmark Mixtrack Pro 3. You have your microphone, and you have your headphones. Now, of course, you would not normally have this stuff here. This is the case for your microphone. This here, without me opening it, this cable is for the audio signal to go from your Mixtrack Pro 3 into your powered speakers. Now, if we take a look at the back of the Mixtrack Pro 3, we have two RCA out. So you'll take one of the cables from one side and just channel that around the base of the console and then up to the back of your Alto TX215 powered speaker. And then you will go into the input here. Make sure the switch is set to line and not mic. This is your trim, your volume control. Ideally, set that to zero dB. This, of course, is the input. And here is your power on and off. Once you've set that up, exactly the same on the other side. Of course, then, you'll need to plug in your laptop. One of the great features about the Mixtrack Pro 3 is it's bus powered. So there's no need for any external power supply because the power used to run this will come from your laptop. Always make sure that your laptop is either fully charged and you understand how long your laptop will last fully charged, but to make sure, I highly recommend you always plug your laptop in during an event. The worst thing in the world is two or three hours, you look and you're on low power mode. You don't want that to happen. Okay, now the stands, the tripods come in a bag. Headphones, the cables I showed you. Also, the console as well comes in a Gorilla Stands bag. So, lighting. Now, what Get In The Mix have done, I've tried to think of everything. One of the worst things in the world is when you've got the likes of a T-bar or maybe some kind of truss for your lighting. One of the worst things is to have a power socket, a four-way, shoved half halfway up so people can see it. Now, even though the kettle leads are quite short on the lights, what we've incorporated is extension male and female cables. So when you get your lights, you won't plug in the original kettle lead into the light, plug in the extension first, and then into the extension, plug in the kettle lead, and then that will go down to one of the two four ways that will be supplied with the complete package. Now, the four ways will take, first of all, one plug 
your powered speaker. One plug for one light. This light here has the lead down to the floor. Now at the moment that four-way has got three plugs inside it. The other plug is for the light that I placed on the floor that's illuminating the front of the console, which leaves one extra plug. Of course, that can be used for your laptop. If we go to the other side, I've now got the Onyx in the center, and I've got the other American DJ light on the left-hand side. And again, don't plug in the original kettle leads into these. Plug in the extensions first. You should get two meter extensions. Extensions first. Make sure you've neatly wrapped the cables here. And then, once you get to the bottom, you plug in the kettle leads into the extensions into your second four-way that comes with the package. Also, you've then got the other plug from the powered speaker that will plug into your four-way as well. And again, you've got one more free plug to plug in maybe the power supply for your iPhone. Okay, so what you've got here from getting the mix, like I said earlier, is the complete package for the mobile DJ. You don't have to think about buying extra lights. You don't have to think about what other cables do I need. You don't have to think about should I get powered speakers, passive or active. Get in the mix, have thought of everything for you. So within one phone call, one phone call, you can get a whole DJ setup to become a mobile DJ. Practice and enjoy.